Hey guys, it's Jason here and welcome back to the channel and welcome to another video. Um, about a month and a bit ago, guys, I think it was, Trax has debuted their Deep Tracks. Uh, these are the Deep Terrain Tracks. Um, they were kind of a, a real must-have upgrade if you had the tracks. Um, pretty much, you know, I was super excited when I got this truck. I bought it for my son. Thought it would be a, a blast in the snow. Um, but unfortunately, with these tracks just not being very deep, when it came to running the truck in the snow, it didn't perform the way uh, you were hoping for. So when they obviously released these, I was like, oh, finally, this is a must-have upgrade. Ordered them. Unfortunately, uh, they took about a month and a bit to get here. And since then, we've had a lot of weird weather. We've had snow. We've had rain. We've had, uh, you know, a lot milder temperatures. So my snow is kind of, a lot of the snow here is melted. And now it's got like that more of a rocky kind of crusty feel to it because it's it's melted and then froze, melted and then froze. But either way, guys, we are going to unpackage these things, take a look at them. I'm going to take out uh, the tracks with the stock treads, kind of rip that around for a bit, you know, try to hit some inclines to, so we can see how that performs. And then switch it over, guys, to the deep tracks and see just how much of an improvement um, the deep tracks are over the regular stock tracks. tracks. Uh, hopefully that made sense. Um, anyways, here we go. Right, guys so we got them out of the package and there's definitely guys a nice um as you can see here especially compared to the stock ones guys there's a huge difference um i would say yeah no the um i just wanted to see if they felt any different like the compound or anything like that but um you can definitely see that the paddles are a lot more increased on this um you know, you should definitely get a lot more dig now when you're going through. So you know what? Instead of just me talking and wasting your time, let's get the truck outside. We'll take it for a quick little boot, see how she does with these pedals on or with these tracks on, and then we'll come in and we'll switch them over to these. Right, guys, there you have the stock trucks in the snow. Um, oddly enough, from the time that I went out this morning um, and then went out to do the video, it had actually gotten pretty mild. So the snow is actually pretty sticky out there. Um, so these trucks weren't doing too bad. I actually had to drive um, slower to kind of get the truck to, to, you know, to slip and to, to not get traction so much. So we'll see what happens when we put the new tracks on. Um, 
obviously they're going to dig in a lot better. They should perform a lot better. So let's get to it. First, guys, we're going to start right here with this screw. It releases the tensioner. Um, if you look in the, the, the instructions that actually come with um, these tracks and the truck in general, there's supposed to be a 2.5 millimeter gap right here. We can check that too. But I've removed these tracks, guys, a few times from when, I, when I'm running them, and I just want to kind of clean them up and stuff like that. And I never actually release, release the tensioner. But we'll do it this time, this time just because, hey, that's what they're telling us to do. There we go. So yeah, that immediately, you guys, hopefully you guys saw that, it immediately released it. And we can now just get these off. There's all the water from when I was running. We'll, uh, let's clean that up a little bit. But yeah, now these can come completely out. We'll check this gap and we'll make sure we're good to go. All right, guys, I got the track uh, mounted up. Uh, pretty much after you do the release, you pull it off, put it back on. Um, you just have to put the tensioner back down and put the screw through. Uh, I wasn't going to record that. I don't think anybody needs to watch how to do that. Um, and what I'm going to do, do now, guys, is I'm going to mount up uh, the other three so we can get this thing outside and give it a little test run. All right, guys, that probably took about 90 seconds um, to get those on. They're as simple as it gets. Release the screw, pull the tensioner down, you're good to go. Uh, these definitely look a lot meatier now. Um, Definitely gives it that kind of cool sort of off-road recovery type of look. Um, definitely, definitely liking this. Uh, it's kind of what, to me, in my mind, what this should have been right from the beginning. But uh, let's take this thing outside and give it a drive. Right, guys there you have it uh you can definitely see guys that these tracks perform a lot better than the stock ones um you know even just going into the banks i was able to approach them a lot slower than i did uh with the stock tracks on and still get up no problem um definitely in my opinion guys um a must have upgrade you know if you have the tracks as tracks now um these are definitely uh something that you want to pick up i feel like a lot of people got the tracks whether they got the trx4 tracks full truck or if they just bought the tracks separately um i noticed so many people buy them and then sell them right after because i don't they i'm assuming it's just because they didn't perform the way they wanted them to um with these upgraded tracks the truck definitely feels a lot better and definitely performs a lot better so um in my opinion if you've got if you if you hung on to your tracks definitely pick these up um because you will definitely see guys a huge increase in performance um and and to be fair they just even look better <laughs> it, it, the truck now looks more rugged um you know i kind of a friend of mine's doing it already but i may copy him uh he's doing more of kind of like an adventure uh recovery type theme on his truck type thing i think that'll be pretty cool um but anyways guys as always stay tuned there's a couple of picks to follow after the video and again if you like this video uh, give me a thumbs up and please subscribe. Anyways, guys, have a great day. Stay healthy.